Hey, what's up guys? Dr. Tim Wu, SoCal Bike PT, coming to you with another video on how I tend to use rock tape with my athletes that are having some knee pain. So Daniel here is one of my longtime clients. He's a Ironman triathlete, state champion, bike racer. He's having some issues on the bike and with running with his knee. For him specifically, we're working on kind of some glute activation stuff. But he's having some pain and tightness through his adductor compartment and a little bit through the front of the knee here. So for this application with some of the rock tape that we're gonna use is to kind of bring down some pain so he can go train today, but also to calm down any of his compensatory muscles that are on this side and make his knee feel more stable, all right? So as with all things, we start with your rock tape. I like the, um, the standard for this situation because he's not in the water. The extra stick is good if you're going in the water, but today we're running. So you're gonna take a piece. We're gonna go up into the adductor compartment. You're gonna start at the bottom of the knee angle all the way up to kind of where you want to end. Make your first cut there. So now here is the veteran move when you're doing the rock tape and you're gonna put it on someone who's gonna move a lot. You take the ends, you're gonna to want to round those off. That way they don't catch on clothing and they stay on longer. So round off the other end. A good sharp scissors always help. There we go. So once we have that, at each end of your rock tape that you're going to apply, you want to tear just through the backing. That's to be your anchor strip. That's where you're going to attach one end and the other end where you put no stretch. So we got our anchor strips. Mind you, for best application, try not to touch the adhesive so you can pull just the backing off. For Daniel here, we're going to start on the outside of the knee, a little below the patella, kind of over where the fibular head kind of is. Put it on there. I'm going to rub the tape on. Again, not touching, the, not touching the adhesive, taking the backing off. Now with his knee bent, for him, I'm gonna do no stretch because we just wanna have a little nervous system input to feel like it's more stable. And angle it up over here, kind of go around where his VMO is, up towards where his problem region is, and end towards the middle of the leg there. And then the adhesive, to get it to stay on, it's heat activated, so you can just rub it like crazy. There we go. To stay on there. And that's the first half. Uh, if it's just this part of your leg that's having a problem, this works really well. I tend to do the double, so the kind of medial side, the inside of the leg, as well as the outside portion. So you can cut another strip of rock tape, starting in the medial or inner part of your knee, ending over kind of on your IT band area. We'll cut that tape again. Veteran hack number two, take your tape, fold each end on each other and then when you make your cut one it saves time and then the cuts are exactly the same there we go you like that better yeah, that's the better, better, better move. move and now this is not the first time I've done this on Daniel I've actually taught him how to do it on himself the knees an easy one to do on yourself because your knees right in front of you you just got to get yourself like Daniel's got his own kind of like personal roll rock tape he takes with him uh, along with the other like rock sauce and his like uh, mobility balls so then take the anchor strip off starting kind of on the medial side of the knee just below kind of where the knee joint is again don't touch the adhesive because the skin the oils on your skin will kind of mess with that take the backing off take the backing off then we're going to fall around the outside of the knee go up Kind of follow the IT band because he's got some IT band things sometimes. Full of issues. Full of issues, but you know, for all the athletes out there, they're especially stepping up training. Like Daniel's in the middle of a big block of building right now, so it's important that he gets that training in to build his engine to stay on track for his goals. But we don't want to completely stop training right now. So now that we got the tape on there, great. We got the strip right here. We got the strip right here. We're gonna add a little bit of movement in there. Kind of see how it feels. And that's a good one, okay? So, in summary, if you're having knee pain kind of like on the inside of the knee, up into your adductor compartment, or having anything that's kind of in the front of your knee, it's going out to the side. The principle we're using here is if there's a region where it hurts and it's kind of feeling sensitive, just putting the tape on it without stretch or anything helps tell your nervous system, hey, this is going to be okay, be a little bit safer. And then for mechanically speaking, it's going to decompress some of the layers of tissue that are moving around here. 
So especially for repetitive activities like cycling or for running, we get a lot of tissue shear. This is gonna help that glide a little bit better, buy him some more time in competition and allow him to train today, all right? Good job, Daniel. Thank you.